Hi everyone, Heather Liu here uh, over at Closet Core Patterns, coming to talk to you about our April 2024 pattern for crew, our monthly pattern membership, the mic address. I had to figure out what direction I was pointing in. The mic address. Um, this is a beautiful sleeveless dress with a really high modern kind of almost racerback neckline that I love. The version I'm wearing right now is was like a kind of a test sample uh, when we were developing the pattern. So a few things are different. I think the neckline is slightly narrower and I think the armhole is slightly higher. Um, but when I was uh, in Vietnam on my trip, I wore this like almost every other day. I absolutely loved wearing this dress. And it's a really perfect combination of a slightly vintage kind of 50 silhouette that fit and flare fitted bodice with a more flared skirt but i think with a very cool contemporary modern edge which is coming from this high cut small um, neckline and then a high almost racer back silhouette through the shoulders so it's narrow through the shoulders it's narrow through the back and then it has this high neckline and combined with the kind of fitted bodice and the slightly more A-line flared skirt, I think is just a really cool silhouette. And it just is a bit of an update on this 50s, 50s uh, fit and flare dress that I think is really interesting. So some of the interesting things about Mica is that the bodice is fully lined, but my favorite detail is actually the closures on this dress. So I think generally when you have a fitted uh, dress like this that's shaped with darts like this one is, and for Micah, the darts are coming up. You have darts coming up through the waist in the front and the back. Um, in our extended size version, we actually have double darts in the front to help uh, fit larger busts. Um, whenever you have that kind of fit, that fitted bodice, they're generally closed with an invisible zipper, not mica. This is why this pattern is really special, and this is one of the reasons I'm so excited about it this month. So I love to go shopping and try on clothes and look at how clothes are constructed. And three or four years ago, I tried on a dress that it was a sleeveless dress that closed kind of like this. And so essentially what it was is there's buttons on the side that help close the side seam instead of a zip zipper. And so it's, instead of having that side zipper along the side seam, it's actually done up with buttons. So first of all, this is an amazing opportunity to dig through that tin of buttons you probably have in your stash. You know, you have like three of a button. You're like, what am I going to do with three buttons? Well, you're going to put it into the side seam of the mic address. Um, and the whole thing is also integrated with a pocket. So there's almost like a placket that extends past the side seam and center front. And then the butt, the pocket is all integrated. It's just a really cool detail. It's something that you probably haven't seen before. It was a really fun detail for us to figure out how to construct. And I think it just gives a cool, interesting construction feature to what is really like a classic, very kind of minimalist, pure silhouette. The other pretty detail, again, another opportunity for buttons. So the center back, we just left a little bit of an opening so you can get your neck in, and they overlap just a little bit like this. And again, you have two buttons that do up. I'm not gonna do them up here, but you get the idea. So it's just this like little pretty overlap detail on the back that I think is so pretty. And so I would say it's like a little bit more flared than A-line. It's got a little bit of movement. Of course, if you want it to be more flared, you can always add more flare to your skirt. It's a very easy adjustment. But we're just thrilled with this pattern. I think it's so cool. And as we are getting into the spring and summer, it is perfect for more structured wovens. So anything that, anything cotton, a broadcloth, even a quilting cotton, shirtings, um, lightweight twilled work. You think about those kind of lightweight, light to mid weight uh, wovens that have like some structure and crispness are absolutely perfect for this. Linen is a beautiful choice. Um, what we realized in the development of it is we don't love it in a drapey fabric. So um, in the, some of the, the samples that we made for one of our models, the color is beautiful, it looks great on her, but we found using this really um, eco vero viscose, we just found it didn't have enough body and structure to really support all of these seams. And so I really recommend just going with something that has a little bit more structure when you're choosing your fabric. And then I thought it would just be fun to show you a little bit of our development process, what, you know, what we're thinking about and how we're working on these patterns before we even kind of get into final samples. Um, I think sometimes it's just fun to understand our process. And for a simple dress, this actually went through quite a bit of revision. We, um, you know, started with the bodice and kind of realized we wanted it to be a lot more fitted. 
Um, we really started pushing the shoulder seam closer and closer together because I wanted a really close high neckline and so that was something that changed a lot. We even were experimenting with, you know, do we want to have like an opening along center front? And we actually drafted a sleeve, this kind of handkerchief sleeve um, that we tried to make work because we were thinking, you know, there are some people who don't like showing their upper arms and so we thought maybe we'll give them a sleeve option. But ultimately, like, we just settled on this is so pure and perfect. We don't want to try to, like, hack a sleeve on there just to, that doesn't quite work. Um, when you have the purity of this expression. And then if you're one of those people who doesn't like showing off your upper arms, you know, this is what cardigans are for. This is what jackets are for. This is what shrugs are for. Put a long sleeve or a short sleeve t-shirt or a little turtleneck under this, wear it like a pinafore, I think would be so cute. There's lots of different ways to style it. Um, and we just love this neckline. I think it just looks amazing on everybody. It frames your face. It's a great opportunity to play with jewelry, a great earring, a cool necklace. And one other thing that I want to talk to you about in terms of construction is if you are as obsessed with this beautiful chevron bodice as we are when we were sewing it, all you have to do is add a center front seam to the front bodice and then cut each side on the, bi on the bias, making sure that you're matching your stripes and you can create a similar chevron shape. So the pattern doesn't actually have the center front seam, but we wanted to show that as an opportunity for kind of playing with stripes because I think this is a very, very fun dress for stripes, especially when they're beautiful wide ones like this one. So Micah is available as a pattern when you join crew. And if you haven't joined us for crew before, just to let you know how it works, um, you can dip in and out. There's no obligation. There's no you know, minimum amount of time that you want to join. If you just want to kind of come in and grab Micah this month, you can. However, if you want to join at our unlimited annual level, it's an amazing deal because you get Micah, you get the last 15, 16 patterns that we have in the crew library, and then you get the next 12. Um, and this year, our focus is on this beautiful kind of quiet luxury collection we're calling the Stone Collection, which Micah is a, a part of. And so we are helping you build a really beautiful modern capsule wardrobe this year using patterns. And so it's just a wonderful opportunity to kind of discover your personal style, um, have fun with the kind of ideas and design concepts we're exploring this, uh, this year. And then, of course, maybe inc up your sewing level. Um, what we're doing this month for this pattern is a full video sew along. So if you're feeling a little bit nervous about this, if you're kind of maybe struggling with that button closure, we're gonna walk you through the entire construction of this start to finish. We've also created a downloadable bodice fitting guide. So if you're, for whatever reason, struggling to fit that bodice, we've got tons of help and resource to help you identify those fitting problems and then solve them. Now, if you enjoy with our unlimited package, you also get access to our fitting room, which is where we call a private forum. It's for only unlimited annual members, where you can go with your fitting problems to our fitting expert, Gabby Brown, and she is, has office hours every week where she is there to solve your fitting problems. So you get the patterns, past patterns, you get the future patterns, you get fitting help, you get fitting resources. It's a lot of fun, and our community is like one of my favorite places on the internet right now. So if you wanna go share what you're making, we're not on Instagram, we're not on Facebook. It's our own private, really supportive community. And if I sound like I'm proselytizing, it's because I am, because it's really fun what we're doing and we want you to join. So get Micah this month. Can't wait to see you over at Crew and I absolutely can't wait to see what you make with this pattern.